Now for the door swings on these French doors that I've placed on the side over here. Uh, door swings I've already showed you over here, so this is going to be really quick. Um, it's a little different because they are double doors. And to do the door swing, it's real simple. Uh, same thing, choose an arc. And let's see, I think it was start in radius. Is that the one we did last time? I think, I don't remember. Let's try that. So, and I just realized I need to place another piece of geometry. And again, it's that center line that I should not have deleted. So let me go back and draw that line again. And you know, that's kind of what happens when you're doing this. I can't remember everything. Okay, so arc. Okay, so it's going to start here. It's going to end right there in the center. And then, of course, establishing your radius. And, of course, I'm backwards, as usual. So let's try it the other way around. Start here in the middle and bring it to the end of the door. And then there is your arc. And get yourself a good concentric arc there are perpendicular with the outer wall okay and you can also mirror this simply by clicking on mirror clicking on the object enter and then the mirror line start point here and then we're just going to drag it this way or actually right there and uh, we're not going to erase the source object okay so there is your double French door and we can go ahead and get rid of that line and again hopefully we won't need it but hey you never know so there's your French door um, in the next video we'll show you how to make um, the uh, folding bifold doors stay tuned